Growing Healthy. Okay, this is Growing Healthy. We're back outside the garden. NBC 26 joining us is Jamie, of course. And Jamie, I, I got to tell you, you, you mentioned the spaghetti squash. I've already done the spaghetti squash. It is such a great alternative to, you know, your, your typical carb loaded <laughs> right. pasta. And it, it's great. So maybe first let us know when it's good to pick the, the squash that we have. Um, and which when we know it's ready to go. Right, so your spaghetti squash is ready to go when it gets this nice dark yellow color okay. on it. And one thing I do want to mention is how spaghetti squash is one of those squash that can be grown on a trellis. Nice, yep. Otherwise they spread out in the garden and they take up all this room. Right. But spaghetti squash is really great at putting out tendrils and grabbing on. And you were saying trellis. people were really surprised when they saw we were doing that. Yeah, yeah, I got some surprise. But this is, it's a great squash for small garden spaces. It's done really well for us. So once you get the spaghetti squash, now what you want to do is you get this nice guy here. Basically, it, the, the hardest part is, is splitting it. <laughs> And get they're it hard. Open. Yeah, they're very hard. But once you get it split, you take, you know, a good sturdy knife or however e the easiest way to do it. And you bake it roughly about 350. Okay. And then the good thing is, is when you get it baked, you just take a fork. And right now it's hard because it's raw. But once it's baked, this this scrapes into what would look like a natural spaghetti, like a real, real okay. vegetable spaghetti. And you can add whatever sauce or whatever, you know, pasta that you like to make typically. It yeah. really works out great. Yeah. So, you might want to add a little bit of butter. Uh, that's about it. But really, I'm a huge fan. You guys should enjoy it. Thanks, Jamie. This You're is welcome. Growing Healthy. Well, a cup of spaghetti squash has roughly 40 calories compared to 220 calories in a cup of pasta. It also has a quarter of the carbs. And as always, for more gardening tips, head over to our website, NBC26.com.